What's up? What's up? What's up? Halftime, read a reaction, halftime. What's up? What's up? What's up? Here live on TikTok. I'm the commish. This is our read a reaction. TikTok halftime show. It's preseason, so you know, we're gonna jump on and do some little extra coverage here over on TikTok. It is halftime. Raiders up. 10 to 6. Stidham's looks Stidham's looks solid. I think uh I don't want to hand the reins to uh, to Stidham, obviously, but uh, to be the guy that's going to be, maybe you need to fill in for a series here or there if Carr gets a you know a bump or a bruise. He's looking solid, man. Second rushing touchdown. He's uh, he's aware in the pocket. He's looking good. But at the end of the half, a little questionable on the on the couple of the passes there at the end of the half, but I've, as a whole, Stidham started the whole first half, kept the car in the garage. This looks solid. What's up, Metal? Metal Richards, what's up, my man? Solid. Uh, they've looked good. They've looked good. Um, they've, it looks like a disciplined team. They come out continuing that wrinkle, man. Continuing that wrinkle of, of passing to out of the backfield that has been a staple of the Josh McDaniel offense, using the running backs as an extension of the passing game, and that continues. It is 10 to 6 right now. Raiders are up. Uh, Raider user there. Raider fan user who asked what's the score. It is 10 to 6 right now. Uh, Raiders should have scored on that first drive, man. 15 plays on the opening uh, drive for the Raiders. Um, Vikings got the ball first. Raiders got the ball in the second drive. Went 15 plays, man. Drove it all the way down inside the 10. Should have scored, but left with a field goal. So, that was a solid dominant opening drive. Solid dominant opening drive. Um, just you, you got to you got to finish in the red zone. But then did get the touchdown. The next one a uh, route a uh, back. But it's preseason, man. You you can't call it, you but choked. When you're running with third string running backs and fourth string running backs and fucking. Nobody, none of the starters on the offensive line are in the position. You're fucking playing a rookie at center. Your uh, Illuminor is playing the left tackle position, but choked. What kind of window licking fucking clown are you, man? Jesus Christ, man, you you look windows for fun. We know that. Now nah, Thielen didn't play. Uh, cousins, I haven't. Uh, cousins didn't play because of COVID. Uh, you didn't see much of the Raiders starters at all, really, on offense. Uh, no Jacobs, um, obviously no Waller. He's still nursing that. Uh, they're being easy with him on the hamstring. Um, no Adams. Um, no Colton Miller. Still a big mystery on Brandon Parker. They still really have said nothing about Brandon Parker. And that's been a big mystery, man. Raiders Wire, uh, the USA Today site, came out and said uh, last week that he was going to be out for the season with a torn tricep. And now they have since deleted that story off of their site. You can find the link to the story if you Google it. But if you click on that link, that story is now gone. So it's a little uh, what's up with that right tackle position. Yeah, man, it's just a testing game. Exactly, exactly, Daniel Ortiz. Understand, it's preseason. It's like glorified practice. This is when you get down there in the red zone and you try goofy shit sometimes that you normally would never try. Let's try that play. We've been working on that. We want to see what the percentage is of this happening on that play. But you, just, you don't, it's, come on. You don't run anything you would normally run. It's fucking ridiculous. You want to go out, see that they're being disciplined, um, they're continuing to drink the Kool-Aid, they're understanding the system. Hopefully they have Sue on the line. Anthony coming in with uh, big wishes here late in uh, into the process. Sue's still out there though, man. Somebody's going to scoop him up. And, you know, his asking price has to be ratcheting down at this point. It's not look good, Chris. It's not look good, man. But you got to remember, you got like Green out there playing in the position that Mad Max would be in. Um, you know, you not you got Chandler Jones on the field. You don't know Denzel Perryman. I mean, you're missing some pretty key guys to this defense. I mean, so it's hard to grade, man. You can't, you really got to look at individuals and see how they're doing and grade everything on a curve. 
Greet everything on a curve. What's up, everybody? What's If you haven't followed us on TikTok, man, smash that follow button. We plan on using TikTok as a big extension, as an extra tentacle of our Raider Reaction brand this season. We are new here this season, so... Hey, what's up, David Albert? So if you are here just uh, finding us on TikTok, we are Raider Reaction Sports on Facebook, Raider Reaction on YouTube, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, and every goddamn thing else. But we got to be Raider Reaction Sports on Facebook because they deleted our page last year. Our page that was up for five plus years because, you know, social media censorship's a bitch. But we know how to play their games now. So we're coming over here and we're playing over here too. Preseason is practice. Exactly, Mike. Exactly, Metal. It's practice. It's glorified scrimmage, man. It's just, they're making TV money off of it. They're getting season ticket holder. This is looped in season ticket holder packages. It's all about money, man. This is all about money. That's what preseason is. I'm sure these guys would just rather have organized practices and scrimmages. 55 years. What's up, Eric H., Raider fan to the bone? Make sure to follow us this season, man. We've got a lot of stuff planned. We've got prizes. We've got a, a fancy football league, all silver and black, that we're getting ready to kick off. A draft is this coming weekend on 821. We've got raffles first Thursday of every month coming. Uh, Raider Nation Report podcast every Tuesday. The return of El Parata. He's coming back in about a week or so. Check it out. Check it out. Do the Raiders have the most... Outstanding warrants among their fan base. Oh, man. Oh, look, it's a comedian. It's an out-of-work comedian in the audience. Oh, man. Don't quit your fucking day job, bro. That was fucking lame. I mean, if you're going to come in and try to clown and try to be that guy in the comments, at least step with something worth it. I mean, you even got time to think it through before you hit post. And that was the best that you fucking came up with? Fucking straight window liquor. <laughs> yeah, that was that was pretty lame, Christopher. I don't know. I don't know. Some people just uh, don't know. Hey, I'm going to jump off here. I've got a couple things I want to hit up here before I get back in uh, for second half action. I'll be live on Raider Reaction Sports on Facebook and Raider Reaction on YouTube with our official post-game podcast, the post-game reaction. So check me out on there, and then I'll jump back on here for a little informal reaction with uh, with you guys over here on TikTok for our post-post game reaction. So let's go check out the second half. Knock on wood. Let's hope for no injuries and continued uh, continued. Looks like um, comprehension of the schemes, man. Uh, I think that's what I would say. I, I brightest spot that I've seen on defense thus far. Koontz looks solid, and Darius Phillips, man, looks like a big pickup from Cincinnati. This dude looks good. They've got him working, uh, returning punts. He was all over the field in the Hall of Fame game, and he continues. Look for number 20 in the second half, man, if he even gets out there in the second half. But he's been uh, all over. Well, I'll see you back here, man, for the post-post game. But come check out that post-game official podcast on uh, Raider Reaction Sports on Facebook. I'm out. Peace, love. Raider Nation.